So I was able to access um, Medicaid services um, for my for my daughter. Um, some of the barriers that I found in in Medicaid is. Um, it depends on some of those open enrollment and the level of your disability. As I've, as I've um, worked with people in this line of family resource facilitation and wraparound um, and trying to help them get Medicaid um, and disability Medicaid has been challenging um, because of the diagnoses issue, you know, is there is there a, an official diagnosis? Has that is that diagnosis? Um, been made official. Some of them have, some of them haven't. I feel like there's a barrier to that. And then I myself, as I struggled in that area um, with becoming more independent with the disabilities that I struggle with um, and having Medicaid and then being dropped off of Medicaid and then worried about, okay, like, am I going to be able to still have the resources that I need? Am I still going to be able to see the same primary care doctors? And, and um, with the therapy that I was even working with that I could no longer see that therapy because they were not a pro provider of Medicaid. And so there, there was some struggles there with that.